Ahmed Jazar is believed to have been born around 1722. He was born a village around the historic city of Mostar in Bosnia-Herzegovina. He began his military career in Egypt in the service of various Mamluk officials, eventually becoming a chief enforcer and assassin working for Ali Bey al-Kabir, Egypt's effective ruler. He gained the epithet of Al-Jazar for his deadly ambush on a group of Bedouin tribesmen in retaliation for the death of his master in a Bedouin raid. In September 1775, he was appointed as garrison commander of Acre following the Ottomans' defeat of Zahir. Confident of yet another triumph, Emperor of the French, Napoleon Bonaparte had even set a precise date for the capture of Acre. He conveyed to his officers that this would be the 25th of April 1799. However, the troops of Jezer Pasha, refusing to surrender, withstood the siege for two months. The Pasha had the city fortified and had been particularly relying upon his core troops comprising fellow Bosniaks, Albanians and other loyalists. As many as eight repeated attempts to capture the city, were fended off with fierce resistance, put up by its defenders who had British naval support. On 20 May 1799, Napoleon Bonaparte lifted the siege of the city of Acre. Ahmed Jazar Pasha's defiant and successful stand at Acre, not only halted Napoleon's march onto Damascus and Constantinople, but also put an end to his dreams of an empire in the east. At the back of the mosque built in 1781, by Al-Jazar, a room contains the graves of Jazar Pasha and his successor and adopted son Suleiman Pasha.